in traceable. Slay, Stein, Fahrenheit. Accepting, fiery, hierarchy, hieroglyphic. E-I is also used in special words that merit careful study. E before I after C. Seizure, leisure, see sheep, protein. Rear, either, neither, codeine, caffeine. Siege, however, is spelled I-E. Otherwise, use I-E in thief, belief, fiend, niece, feel, brief, grief, cashier, achieve, yield. Only one word in the language ends in S-E-D-E. -E. Supersede. Three others end in C-E-E-D. Exceed, proceed, succeed. All others end in C-E-D-E. -E. Exceed, concede, intercede, precede, recede, secede. E before I after C. When a word ends in C, like frolic and picnic and mimic, insert a K before adding a suffix. Beginning with F, I, or Y, E, I is used immediately after the letter C. The single exception is financier. E, I is used in words in which it has the sound of A, or the sound of I, as in height. Slay, Stein, Fahrenheit. E, I is also used in special words. Leisure, seizure, see, sheep, protein. Weird, either, neither, codeine, caffeine. Use I-E in thief, belief. Fiend, feel, brief, grief, yield, achieve, cashier. Accept, after, see, as in, exceed, proceed. Succeed, exceed, concede. Intercede, proceed, recede, succeed. I before E, except after C. Less C, before C. Uh, C I S O L V E. Dissolve. That stupid Charlie Brown, he's going to get it this time. He's up against some of the best spellers in the school. All braces. A S B R A S S I Z. All braces. Stomach? Oh, stomach ache. That's an easy one. Stomach ache. S T O M A C H hyphen A C H E. Stomach ache. <laughs> Embarrassment. E M B A R A S S M M E N T. Embarrassment. He missed it. Boy. Here's my turn. The word is perceive? Yes, I know the word. I before E except after V. Oh, boy. That blockhead will never get this one. Uh... <clears throat> Perceive. P-E-R-C-E-I-V-E. -E -E. Perceive.
admit it, but this could mean the start of something great for Charlie Brown. He may have to get an agent. Of course he'll need an agent. Our glorious victory must be capitalized upon. Let's see. As agent, I shall get 10%. Or is it 15% of Charlie Brown? Perhaps this calls for incorporation. Lucy Van Pelt, Inc. Hmm. I guess you really have to start boning up on your spelling, Charlie Brown. Boning up? What for? I just won. Boy, I wouldn't go through that again for anything. What? 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 I guess I showed him. I guess old Charlie Brown came through. Phew. What a relief that's over. What? What do you mean, over? It's over. I won. And I won't ever have to go through such an ordeal again. Why, you blockhead? This is just the beginning. Of course, Charlie Brown. This is only the beginning. Sure, Charlie Brown. This is only the beginning. Charlie Brown, this victory makes you our representative to the National Elimination Spelling Bee, second grade. National Eliminations Spelling Bee? Ugh! Well, I can see that this blockhead needs help. It isn't just the nationals. There's personal appearances after that, testimonials, perhaps TV appearances. A manager of my caliber is the answer, Charlie Brown. In fact, I'm not sure if 15% is enough. My valuable presence is easily worth 20%. Good grief. The first thing we must correct is your posture. Judges of a contest can be influenced by poor posture. Your grooming is very important. Let's spruce up these clothes, Charlie Brown. You need a haircut, too. I can see that we're going to have to work with you. Patty, what do you think? Well, we should check his walk. If he's going to stumble around like he usually does, 